Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we gonna check out top 3 best portable projectors. Starting at number 3, the Toma ML750 Saint. Well projectors can come in a variety of shapes and sizes, like any piece of technology it's what's under the hood that counts. The Atoma ML750 ST isn't terribly attractive, but it is an absolute workhorse packed into a relatively small frame, outputting 700 ANSI lumens with an astonishing 20,001 contrast ratio. When you need professional presentations from a projector that won't take up much space, the Atoma ML750 ST absolutely delivers a high-quality picture with minimal fuss. The molded white plastic square box isn't going to win any aesthetic awards, resembling a small, hand-sized box with a cylindrical focus lens shoved into one side. The device measures 4. 4x4. 8x2. 2 inches, accounting for the lens sticking out a solid inch in the front, and is amazingly lightweight at just under 1 pound. A rubber lens cap is provided to protect the exposed lens, when not in use, and attaches to the device with a cord. Every side of the projector features vents and fans. The rear includes the tiny speaker and all the important ports, USB, HDMI MHL, Micro South Dakota, 3. 5mm audio jack, DC power jack, and Optoma's unique universal IOA, which connects to VGA with the supplied cable. The bottom includes a standard threaded hole for mounting on a tripod, and three rubber feet. The front foot can be unscrewed to slightly raise the front of the projector without the need of a tripod. The Optoma ML750 ST certainly outclasses most other mini projectors on sheer power alone, as well as the multitude of media ports and display options, but the lack of out-of-the-box wireless connections and uninspired physical design holds it back from top honors. Check out the description for more information and latest price. Coming at number 2. Sony MPC-D1 Portable Pico. In many ways, the Sony MPC-D1 mobile projector closely resembles its predecessor, the Sony MPC-L1 same pocketable size, same simple yet attractive style but it adds one key feature while dropping another. While the MPC-L1 distinguished itself by being one of the few projectors to incorporate a laser-based light engine, the MPC-D1 uses the time-honored digital light processing technology developed by Texas Instruments decades ago, used by about half of the projectors we review. What the MPC-D1 adds is USB Type-C connectivity, which enables fast charging. Image quality is reasonably good for both video and data-heavy images, and the MPC-D1 is indeed hyper-portable, but it's a bit pricey for what it offers. This mini-projector comes equipped with a built-in 5000 mAh rechargeable battery that, according to Sony, can last up to two hours on a charge. In playing a video in our testing on a full charge, the battery lasted nearly that long. The battery can also serve as a power bank-style USB charger for other mobile devices. The Sony MPC-D1 mobile projector is a stylish phone-size mini-projector with a built-in battery. It delivers good overall image quality at a somewhat steep price. Check out the description for more information and latest price. And number 1 of this list, RIF6 Cube. The aptly named RIF6 Cube is a tiny cube-shaped projector, just 2 inches on each side. Its silver frame with black trim give the cube a touch of elegance, and it has its share of useful functionality. For example, you can mirror the screen of an MHL-compatible mobile device connected to its HDMI port or project content from a Microsoft card. But unlike the editor's choice Cellulin Pico Pro, the cube lacks wireless connectivity, which hurts its portability, and its video shows potentially distracting rainbow artifacts. The Cube is a DLP-based LED projector with a rated brightness of 50 lumens and a native resolution of 854 by 480 pixels, both typical for moderately priced Pico projectors. Its native resolution is the same as on both the Lenovo Pocket Projector, which is also rated at 50 lumens, and the Sori's X Project Wi-Fi, with a rated brightness of 100 lumens. Not surprisingly, the RIF6 Cube is a near-perfect cube, measuring 2 by 2 by 1. 9 inches and weighing just 5 ounces. It's a handsome design, with four of its sides made from a single folded sheet of aluminum one side, with a hole cut into it for the lens and the other two sides of black plastic. Geometrically, it resembles the UO Smart Beam Laser Projector, a cube-shaped mobile projector too. 2 inches on a side. The downside of its shape is that it makes the cube hard to fit in most pockets, the RIF6 Cube, a tiny elegant projector that can mirror the screens of mobile devices and project content from a Microsoft card, is good for casual use, although its video quality could be better. 
I have included this product links in the description. You can check out this link for more information and latest price. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel, leave a like and share with your friends.